Guys, Stable Diffusion 3.0 is finally out and it looks pretty great. Here, I'll show you a picture real quick. This is an image generated with Stable Diffusion 3.0. It looks pretty fantastic. You can see that it generates text pretty darn well. You can see that it says go here, dream on, and Stable Diffusion. And we can only assume that all of those things were probably in the prompt. As uh, it says in this article, not only does it look better as far as image quality, but it's also faster. and it follows your prompts better, especially when you have multiple subject prompts. We also covered that it has better topography, which is the text, and it uses an entirely new architecture. It uses a diffusion transformation architecture, uh, which according to this article, or maybe I saw it somewhere else, but it is apparently the same or a similar architecture that OpenAI Sora used. And if you don't know what that is, I highly recommend that you click this uh, link up here where my mouse is circling. Basically, if you don't know what it is, is OpenAI made a new model that generates photorealistic videos and everything you see on the internet can be faked now. So it's completely different from Stable Diffusion 1 and Stable Diffusion 1.5 SDXL and that should give it even better quality as we can see here. Here are some other images generated by Stable Diffusion 3.0, and you can see it looks pretty great. It might be mid-journey levels here, which is incredible for a company that is known for releasing models uh, as open source. Now, right now, it is in an early preview phase, so if you want to join the waitlist, the link will be in the description, and it looks like this and you put in your first name, last name, email, you put in your Discord, um, which kind of makes me think that it might have a closed beta like mid-journey uh, where you can only use it in Discord, but stability.ai are very proudly known for open sourcing all their models so that the community can do whatever they want with them. But that is pretty much it. I just wanted to let you know um, if you're interested in a video that is coming up soon about the best local large language models that you can run on your CPU for programming or just in general, uh, let me know, write a comment. I highly suggest you join the Discord. There will also be a link to that in the description and I hope you have a great day.